Good evening, everybody. This is Celtics A42, and tonight I decided to bring you guys a brand new Let's Play. So yeah, it was it was a matter of time that I was gonna start this Let's Play this soon. Even though I'm just doing this for fun, and the fact that I am a, I am a God of War fan, and so I would like to welcome I would like to welcome you guys to Let's Play. God of War for the PS4. Now, what can I explain about this game? Now, this game is like a um, reincarnation and a uh, sequel to God of War 3. So it's, it's supposed to take place like uh, like years right after, uh, I would say 20 years after uh, God of War 3. I should say years after God of War 3, after uh, Kratos killed all the uh, gods as he got his revenge. So in in this game, God of War 4, as I like to call it, I know most people, most people like to call it of Dad of War or the Last of War, but I'm just gonna call it however however I wanna call it. So so this game is pretty much based off of I want to say based off, but it's gonna focus on on other uh, elements. I'm gonna say right now it's not gonna focus on uh. Greek mythology or anything like that, since the since we write the gods out in the, in the in the third in the third game. Now, ever since this game's been announced at the uh, PlayStation Experience like two years ago, I was really excited for this game, and and this and this game just recently got rated ten out of ten. But now I'm, I'm gonna I, I'm gonna find out for myself how good this game is. All right, let's go to settings first. Okay, the, okay, um, okay, the, my, okay, my freaking, um, option didn't change. It's a good thing. Let's go to audio. Subtitles are on. Okay, I don't think there's no point in me, uh, messing with the options. But yeah, like I said, I was really excited when this game got announced at the, uh, PlayStation Experience a few years back. And I believe this game's been delayed, um, like a few times, I'm not percent sure, but this game recently came out on that Friday, so I went, so I, so I woke up early in the morning, went to go get it, and I played the hell of it. I'm like in chapter uh, two or something, but uh, for now, let's just start a new game. And yeah, there, there's typical settings, there's easy, normal, hard, and extreme. Give me God of War, it's for who... It's for those who want the game is difficult, not possible, require godlike reflection strategy. And yeah, and once you pick extreme mode, give me God of War, you can't you can't change the you cannot change the difficult set you cannot change the difficult settings in the last very second. And I love the fact that you can lock the extreme mode at the very beginning of this game, because normally you have to beat the game casually to unlock it. But due my due to my shitty ass luck, we're gonna play on uh giving you a story, cause why not? And yes, this game does have save slots, thank goodness. Which means that I ain't playing for my main account. Like someone actually like someone actually cares. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, you, you can't even skip this cutscene. So if you wanna do a speedrun of this game, have fun. Now as you can see, Kratos has a beard now. Since he since he got all old. Well, not that old, but he, let's just say he got older. And wow, he still and he still got that scar on his stomach that he got when uh, when Sue stabbed him in uh, God of War 2. All right, hit press square to swing the uh, swing the X. Okay, so now yeah, because I um because I got the control settings in classic, they told me to hit square. Now if you had on D4, you had to hit R1. But yeah, I like playing as class because the thing is that if I, if I put the controls in uh, default, I have to hit R1 and R2 to punch someone. And I'm not that used to it. I like hitting square and triangle to, to hit someone. Huh. Oh yeah, that's where his uh, blades of the thing were attached. Because remember folks, he lost it at the, yeah, he lost at the end of uh, God of War 3. And before he uh, killed himself to release hope. 
And he's alive somehow. Hmm. So yeah, they did imply that Krill's didn't die at the end. Found some. And meet a new secondary uh, protagonist. A new character in the God War series, his son. So yep, so Krill's is a daddy again. Now I can't really. I'm. I, I bet you twenty bucks. I'm, I'm gonna butcher his name. His name is uh, Otorius. I might have butchered that, but uh, at due time I'll get used to pronounce his name. So we're pretty much starting the uh, the prologue chapter. Now, now I'm gonna say right now I'm. I'm not 100% sure I'm going to 100% this let's play. <laughs> but I'll try to get everything I can, like the uh, lost toys and, and all that jazz. Alright, so we just got to walk across to the boat with his circle. Because for some reason, he's taking that big ass tree with him. And we'll find out why. Now, when I first saw the trailer at um, the PlayStation Experience, I the first thing that came to me was it had me think of The Last of Us and Uncharted in a way. <laughs> that is enough. I'm like, yeah, it's just so many ones to play uh The Last of Us and in, in uh, Uncharted all the time. But not that I blame them. I don't blame them really because there is a really fun game. I'm still waiting for uh, The Last of Us Part Two. Man, I can't wait. I can't wait to see how that's gonna turn out. Feels different. Everything is different, boy. Okay, now uh, it's not the, the guy who do the voice of uh, Kratos. It's, it's not the it's not the same guy who voiced the original Kratos in the God of War series one, two, and three. Somebody else. See, as I said, this game uh, has has been rated ten out of ten. Everyone's saying it's a, um, it's, a it's a badass game. Oh yeah, and don't forget that everybody's playing this game, by the way, and I'm like, why not? I guess I'll play it too, because I'm most likely to be playing this game non-stop on my, uh, my main file. That way I can do a let's play this game, that way I don't get too lazy and, and not finish this game, because I really want to get half playing God of War, man. I know everyone's excited for it, I'm sure am. And hell, I already covered the God of War 1, 2, 3 playthroughs on the uh, game Industrials. You guys should check that you guys should check that out. Hell, I even know Pete God, God of War 1 through 3 like like way back. Uh, back when I had a shit ass computer and no headset. And the quality was ass back then. So if you're watching my old God of War videos right now, brace yourself on that. But yeah, this is a prologue chapter, so it's gonna start out a little slow pace. Just like how the last of us started out, a little slow pace. Yeah, take note that X, because we'll be using that a lot. I guess we'll be on this door. Oh, hello. Oh wow, it's a dead body. So yeah, apparently his mom passed away. Oh man, speaking of passed away, yeah, a lot of a lot of actors I've been noticing have died recently. Like, um, oh yeah, I, I already told I already told you guys about the whole um, what's that guy's name? Oh, the guy that play um the 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 Sar Sergeant Hartman on Full Metal Jacket. He passed away not too long ago. Now. Many of me passed away not too long ago. Fern Troyer. They don't know how he died. Barbara Bush passed away. And some wrestler who I don't know passed away today. Like, holy fuck. This is crazy. Oh yeah, Mimi me is like 49 years old. Oh my god, it's like, oh man, oh my god, the way how you approach, it's kind of like how you approach in the, uh, in the, in the PlayStation Experience trailer. 
It's almost at E3, but um... Oh yeah, they announced the same day when they announced The Last of Us Part 2. Oh yeah, in case you wonder, I did finish uh, Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy in case um, your notification didn't pop up on your end for some strange reason. Oh man, it's time to have one hell of a funeral. Oh dude, watch the leg. This is good music. Oh yeah, by the way, this game is way different from the uh, original God of War games. Because, um... As what the sources, um... Explained? Kratos can't jump in this game. Well, I'm not, I'm not really that mad because I'm used to playing games where, where Kratos can jump. But, the only time Kratos can jump is, let's just say, in, in Link style, where you just walk, walk off the ledge and jump. Yeah, that's how. But the only difference is that Kratos does have a jump button when you uh, make him jump off a ledge. So that's good to know. Ooh. Whew. Yeah, I put my hand playing times. Ain't ain't no joke. Squeeze. I never noticed that Marky Hound was here when I first witnessed this cutscene. It was hers. Now it is yours. What did you want? She knew. Show me. Now? But yeah, I think Kratos is a good father. I really love seeing Kratos as a dad. What are we hunting? You are hunting deer. Oh look, and he has a bow. Is that Laura Cross bow? In the direction of <laughs> so yeah, this is pretty much Last of Us, oh. Uncharted, and Tomb Raider. <laughs> huh. Make that for a crossover. Alright, we're about to find our first item. So our prologue chapter I I believe this is chap this is chapter oh. one, technically. Why are we doing this now? I need to know you can survive the journey. Then we leave for the mountain? Depends on you. Hunt. Okay, our first our first item we can't really miss. What did you find? Tracks. Not deer though. I'll keep looking. Okay, we can't do nothing about that lantern. Okay, there's our first uh our first relic or lost toy. Wait. Oh, uh, oh wait, hold on. Oh wait, wait, it's always in the, always in another set. Oh, it's in another um segment. Okay, that kind of threw me off because I thought I was gonna find a lost toy. Let's let's go this way though. Oh, hello. Boy. You miss these. Huh. Close. But also not deer. See? Tips are too wide. Mountains up? Your mother taught you well. Yeah. Trust somebody's footprints. But yeah, I'm gonna try to, um... Uh... I can't promise you guys this is going to be 100% run. Okay, well there is a chest under this bridge. Hmm. And no, we ain't going to find no orbs or anything like that. So we got the hack silver. I still don't know what that does. Oh yeah, I still got the... Oh yeah, I do got the gobble for this game. 
and I don't want to check the guidebook and play the game at the same time. Cause I don't, I don't, I don't want to waste anyone's time. Okay, they would have lost what I was talking about. All right, hold up and view your journal. We found somebody's pirate ship. All right, we already got that chest. I think there's another one somewhere. Oh, oh no, 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 it's not. Okay, now let's uh, follow your son, Vittorio, Notorious. Yeah, but they're two around. Could be a wild boar. Good. Oh. Ain't no now one going for a spring season. Spring season hunting. All right, yeah, this is what I was talking about. When you see a ledge, you hit a uh, circle, jump over gaps. See, we're playing so up in this bitch. Huh. Oh. My goodness, so many elements I'm noticing. This way. All right, hold joystick and hit circle to jump. Okay, there's the deer we're looking for. Slow down, boy. You are hunting deer, not chasing it. Yes, father. Okay, there's another eye we can get, and that's that should give us the uh, another hack silver. And there's another chest up here. And yes, I will be. Re I, yes, I will be. Re I will be playing this again for the game of Dustros in due time. But first, I'm gonna record for my channel first. So be sure to look around. Okay. So now we walk across this bridge and... We broke our bridge. How are we gonna get across? Step aside. All right, now there's gonna be a tutorial on how to use our, uh, our Lef Lefia Axe. Uh, you hit the right uh, D-pad, hold L2 to aim. Press square or triangle to throw the X, or if you had to go control and default, you hit um, R1 or R2 to throw. Wow. Go. And R1 is the, uh, as we call the X. So yeah, you still got some magical powers. So yeah, when you throw your X, you, you, you can always call it back. Hold. What are you doing? Now his guard is up. Only fire. Yeah, you Only went too fire. fast, dude. When I tell you to fire. I'm sorry. Do yeah. not be sorry. Be better. Find it. <laughs> Don't be like any be like, we'll do a better job next week. <laughs> yeah, I should, I should stop making that joke as Steve. He was already won the goddamn Super Bowl. <laughs> Oh, our room was at 20 minutes. You know, we're going to keep the recording going because besides, I know it's the first part and all, but um, it's going to get a little slow pace. Okay, new enemy. Okay, square for light attack, triangle for heavy attack. Hell yeah! Aha! I still need to get I, need, I still need to get used to the uh to the battle. Okay, now the freaking arrows below Kratos, that indicates uh where your enemy's gonna be at. And hit and hold up uh, R3 to target your enemy. Oh yeah, L1 is the uh is the guard. Guard the right time. You get a parry attack. Alright, let me hit up so I can get that out the way. Now watch that makes the fucking thumbnail. <laughs> uh oh, he wants some more. Uh, take that, you sons of bitches. Like I said, I'm still getting used to the uh, to the battle controls, so I'm gonna be a little slow with this. Oh, 
Well, I can't stun the motherfuckers yet. Draugr. Yep, they're called Draugrs. Alright, so we took on the Draugrs. That's a lot of Draugrs. Okay. Now we're gonna go a little north. Okay, this part coming up. Now they want you to uh to go left, but we're actually gonna um take the other direction. We're gonna take this direction first. Follow my lead, boy. And we another test. <laughs> think you see that? Be, think you said to be sarcastic. All right. Oh yeah, there's, there's another. I believe there's another hex silver somewhere next to a uh, dead corpse in this area. See how's everyone? Okay, so technically today is Tuesday, April the 24th. Wow, next month will be May. Oh yeah, I did watch. I did watch a movie on um uh, on Netflix called um um uh, Locked Up. And my God, man, that movie was so goddamn phony. Find the edge, boy. Okay, I don't, I don't remember this area. But we we put to climb up something, I remember. We gotta come up this ledge. Anyway, that that freaking locked up was so goddamn phony. It's about this 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 young girl who was in school and she got bullied and she fought back and she got sent to some kind of penitentiary in, in Japan or something and and she got raped by these by these three officers. And then two seconds later, she has she had lesbian sex with some uh, with that boxing female. Like nothing has happened. I'm like, come on, man, seriously, seriously. I mean, um, you, you got raped by these three dudes, and now you want to have lesbian sex with some random chick? Like what the hell? That's like, oh my god, you keep the fucking dog free. Don't don't show us the pita. Oh, I want to stun the motherfucker. Oh! All right, it's not a lost toy in this segment. The wolves—they weren't me. They were starving. Yes, I imagine they were. Yes, yeah, another toy we just found. Oh, and it, and this this is a new type of chest. And I believe this chest contains a contains a uh, a power up. But let's find out what it is. What? We can no longer use it. We can. Oh, it's another hack silver. But yeah, uh, anyway, speaking of rare, I forgot to mention on freaking dude. You know, the, the movie with it. Wait, there's another. Oh, wait, that's a bear. We can break it if we punch it. Doesn't really give you shit, though. But anyway, the movie dude I was telling you about in the uh, Secret Mana LP. Yeah, the, the one where they showed uh, Lucy Hill's taste for the first time. Well, I forgot to mention that um, she also got raped in that movie by some random dude at a house party. And what I, what I hear about that rape scene is that uh, they just brushed the whole scene off. I mean, the dude was like fucking her and she's like, no, don't, don't fuck me, don't fuck me, or whatever she said. And then he's like, too late, I'm about to come. And, and all of a sudden, she's like, whatever. Like, like the bitch didn't even care that she got raped. Like, what kind of writing is this? But yeah. And some of you guys may ask me how that last me a sex scene went down and um and locked up. Well, it it was pretty much kissing, taking their clothes off. Um, what's her name? I forgot the bitch's name already, but that. The boxing chick laid her down on the bed and started sucking her pussy and all that jazz. <laughs> and she had a shaved one. My God, it's like they went all out on that on that, on that sex scene. Especially when she was, especially when she was getting her pussy sucked by that woman. Like wow. Okay, now this puzzle solving. Okay, now for this part, 
before we open the chest, we gotta break these vase. Now you don't have you don't have to break these vase in a, in a particular order, but it's your choice. All right, let's get your X. You don't really have to throw at it. You can if you want. All right. Oh God, hit the wrong button. I'm just used to playing the uh, the the default joints. And this one over here. And once we hit all the uh, all the the stones, we can open this big chest. Let's see what that's gonna give us. A pooch. All right, one of uh, three apples need to increase your. Oh, okay. So this is this is like the um, this is like the freaking uh, piece of heart <laughs> to get a heart container. So yeah, th this is freaking Zelda written all over it. So since when um, God of War is so fascinated with Zelda? <laughs> Yeah, this is definitely Zelda written all over it now. <laughs> Cause now the, the the freaking green apple, they're your magic meters apparently. Find the nine toll apples in the world just love by magic. Every three you collect increase your maximum health. Oh. That also increase your health, okay. I make sure I ain't missing any lost Okay, we did get a lost toy uh before. And like I said, if I don't um, have a this let's play, that's fine. But I'm really excited this game came out Friday. Alright. So now let's, um, let's, let's take this direction. Hmm, big ass temple. Up there. Oh, there was that deer he was looking for. Told me never to go in there. We do what we please, boy. No excuses. That's kinda true. Besides, this is this is a semi blind let's play after all. So what can be what, what can be buried in the lessons of the hidden temple? Can I have my bow back now? Can you hit it from here? We should get closer. Yeah, now you're sinking. I just love how uh, how Kratos let his son think for himself. <laughs> That's what dads do. I went hunting with mother a bunch of times. To be honest with you, I wouldn't mind being a dad, but no girls want me. It was her wish. So sucks be them, right? Right. Okay. Oh wait, okay, if I remember correctly. Okay, there's more of this little puzzle solving shit coming up. Uh oh, another Draugr. Doing combat, the enemy's health is displayed above them when they take damage or target by Kratos. Alright. Shoot, see? I'm still used to playing in the at the default controllers. Ah, hit the wrong button. See, I'm trying to show off the uh the stun joints. Oh hello. Oh I hate mummies. Huh. Despite the fact they're not mummies. Wow, man, it's so, it's so much better than, than, than not using the fucking, uh, Blades of Athena. Now, up north, this is our, that's our plot point. Alright, take your X out. Here we go, slice that motherfucker. Okay, there is a way to get that chest. But there's a door we can there's a door we can go behind. Okay. Let's take care of this first. Okay, I think I know what's coming up after shortly. Alright, there's there's another one of those big big boss key chest thing. 
Oh, we can't open yet because... Oh! Hello! Ooh, hello. Down, boy. Down! More dragons! Oh, what the fuck? They, I hate how you can't, like, you can't, like, swing while you guard, man. Again, I mean, I am a slow learner. I'm still getting used to the, uh, to the combat. And don't feed the trolls. Yes, father. All right, found another lost toy. Let's see what toy is that. Oh, I don't know what the fuck we found. All right, so now let's go to that um to that chest I tried to open. Yeah, we just, we just couldn't open it right away because we're still fighting the enemies. Another hack silver. Sweet. Alright, we had 30 minutes. Alright. Alright, now let's uh, do a little patch tracking. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do, we gotta uh, pull this chain. Hit circle and press down the, on the, the the joystick. Then you want to aim your X and hit the switch. Frozen in place. Clever. Then go in this room right here to get our other to get the other chest. Oh my God! And we get and we get another hack silver. So now what? Oh yeah, once we uh, go past the gate, call your uh, ex back so we can oh. so we can proceed. Nice. Okay, there's another chest over here. Where you going? To get that chest. Okay, now when we turn back, there should be a chain in front of us. There's a chain over there. We can climb that chain. And that will also take us somewhere. He has to love how when you climb, he'll he'll just hop on your back and climb with you. Uh-oh. Oh yeah, the green things they they refill your health. So what what that does that when you see a red pot, when you throw your X at it, it's an explosive bomb! Alright, but first let's um let's throw the thing at the at the barrel. Oh god damn it hit the wrong button. Alright, let's stand back and throw the X at the joint. Oh and we open the door. There's another chest we can get. Okay. Shoot, I don't even know if we got time to get to the get to the first mini boss, I would say. Oh, okay. We just gotta break this down. You can punch with your fists. And open that up. Yeah. Boy. Oh look! It's Skull and Hati. The giant wolves who chased the sun and moon. Where did they come from? How did they get up there? I have no idea. So they, at the end. they eat the sun and moon? And then everybody fights? Alright, we found one of those um those things. <laughs> Oh yeah, the freaking, um, the shrine, that's what it's called. I can't pronounce the J word. It's called a Jotar Shrine. Alright. 
No, I guess we can keep going. Yeah, don't be surprised if. Uh, oh, hello. Don't be surprised if each part comes out like like super long. <laughs> yeah, when I first um when I first seen this game in the trailer, I thought this was gonna be like open world, like uh like Breath of the Wild. I mean, I wouldn't mind a God War game being open world, like Breath of the Wild is. Okay, I guess we do got time for that for our, for our first mini balls. So let's just hurry up and um and go trigger it. Yeah, I believe they I believe that they did show us mini balls during the um during the uh patient experience. Oh, I forgot my axe. <laughs> Wait for my mark. Relax. That's a little how he you calls it back. Oh Clear shit. Steady your aim and breathe in. Alright. I got it. Good. Okay, I don't know what have you if you miss. I could assume that curls will scald at you if you miss your shot. But it's like impossible to miss. It's still alive. Oh wow, this heart oh my goodness. I remember watching this cutscene during the um I want to say either E3 or the PlayStation Experience. Your knife. Oh yeah, if you see no. this on the PlayStation Experience, we already you know how it's going to go down. Shoot, even though I've never been a deer hunter, I can already imagine it's not easy killing a deer. Oh man. I Whew. Be honest with you, this was kinda of painful to watch when I watched it on the on the reveal trailer. It was actually when they played the demo, I mean. Oh, shit! And there's our mini boss, the troll. Shoot, man, should fight this motherfucker in, uh, in, in, in extreme mode. Okay. Press R2 to command or to shoot arrows. Hold R2 and press. Okay. Oh god. Okay. Just tell me when to shoot. Oh god. Let me aim my axe at the motherfucker. Throw it at him. Oh god. Oh yeah, it, it did some damage. My god, this motherfucker looks so intimidating. Man, he reminds me of the freaking Minotaur balls off of Castlevania Curse of Darkness. Alright. Yeah, he's strong, alright. Like I said, he reminds me of that Minotaur battle off of uh, Castlevania Curse of Darkness. Oh my god, if you think this boss is fun, wait till we get to the boss at the end of the chapter. It gets crazy, I'll tell you. Crazy. Wow. He 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 was able he's able to block that big ass fucking uh that pillar. What the fuck did I do? Oh, Yeah, you just shoot arrows just to distract him, giving Chris the opportunity to strike him. Ah, whoo, that was 
almost hit me. Oh god. Okay, I'm almost dead. Alright. Like I said, I'm still trying to get used to the controls. Alright, now we got a whole circle. Oh, hello. No more quick time events for you. Which I'm glad. Ugh. Snap that motherfucker's neck. Oh my god. Let the anger out, son. Turn to the dark side. Why is that looking at the Why is that looking at the Skyward Sword symbol for a brief second? At the uh, sacred grounds. You are not ready. Huh? What? Told you. Should have cool while you were ahead, dear. You should have calmed gift. down. I proved myself. How am I not ready? We are going home. I haven't been sick in a long time. I can do this. Hmm, he's you are not ready. So I'm guessing him being sick is gonna be a this gonna be a plot point in the near future. Well, I haven't get to that part yet, so... Yeah, don't tell. Alright, first let me, uh, get my... Get some items, then we gotta return home. But, um... We can save our game by hitting the touchpad. Go to options. Go to save, and we're gonna save it over... Oh, no, that's my main file, so... We're gonna, we're gonna save it over this one. Alright. Oh, okay, okay, it's on the top. Okay, okay, I was getting a little worried. I'm about to say, oh shit, I, I don't want to override my fucking main, my main uh, file because that would truly suck. All right, I guess I guess I'll end the vid by um, where's my good stopping point? Matter of fact, I guess um, I guess this would be my good stopping point. All right, so. That's it for the first part of uh, Let's Play God of War for the PS4. So, hope you guys going to enjoy this Let's Play. Uh. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, I'm out. Yeah, the pause menu is going to be the stopping point from now on. Since I already saved and all. Alright, so that's it for the first part of God of War for the PS4. Hope you guys going to enjoy it because I am damn sure going to look forward to see how this game is going to turn out. Because I am love, I am fucking loving this game to death. I really love it. But when I rate 10 out of 10, well, I have, to play the, I have to play the whole entire game first before I rate that. But, but what, what matters is that I am enjoying this game to half the death. And I hope everyone is too. Alright, so in the, next, in the next episode, let's play God of War for the PS4. We're going to go back home and see what's in store for us. So until next time, everyone, Celtics A42.